Hi, I'm Farbs, and this video covers changes in the Dawnstar Build 6, which you can play if you're a Captain Forever supporter. Last week, I took photos. Canberra, the city where I live, is filled with these beautiful concrete monsters, and they're what I want the space stations in the Dawnstar to look like. This would settle the stations in amongst the asteroids, and it'd help new players tell the difference between space stations and spaceships. Of course, to make the game look like this, I'd need a new renderer. And that's what I worked on this week. The original renderer uses Flash's inbuilt drawing routines, but they run on the CPU, so when you play in full screen, the game slows to a crawl. These days, Flash can access the video card, so the new renderer should not only look cooler, but also run a lot faster. Neat! Since the Dawn Star is played from a top-down perspective, I'm going to use pre-rendered sprites. This means I'll build detailed 3D models, then render them into images. When you run the game, it'll use these image files rather than the high detail models. Pre-rendered sprites can be very fast and very detailed, but they don't work with traditional lighting techniques. To address this, I'm going to try baking directional occlusion maps, and that's what I've been working on. These show how much light the image receives at each point and from every direction, and can be used to create lovely soft shadows. The obvious way to bake these would be with a custom ray tracer, but I have no idea how to write something like that. Instead, I wrote a basic 3D renderer, then set it up to run 10,000 times to simulate 10,000 different light sources. By adding these together, I can create an occlusion map. I can also tint the lights based on where they are in the sky to create a beautiful approximation of global illumination. In theory, the new renderer should create lighting effects like these in-game. This week I also added a new module. The Twin Booster Mark II is a larger and more powerful Twin Booster. If you find any of these in the game, please drop by the forum and tell us where they are. If you'd like to play the Dawn Star, you can sign up as a Captain Forever supporter at CaptainForever.com. To keep track of development, you can subscribe to this channel, follow me on Twitter at FarbsMcFarbs, or check out my blog at Farbs.org. See you next week!